Christian, you can get things started. <coughs> hey, Josh. Uh, Christian Clark here with Noel.com. Stan just talked about, um, you know, preaching to you guys throughout tra training camp of not beating yourselves. Um, just how rewarding was it to have a win where, you know, low turnover total, you, you guys barely let them get to the line? Um, I mean, that's, that's a great win for us uh, because at the end of the day, you can't dictate or can't control if you're making shots, missing shots, um, you know, all you really can control is your effort, um, your attention to detail, your habits, and those kind of things. So we were able to do that. Um, I mean, Stan did a great job during training camp and, you know, since then of uh, helping us with habits, helping us, um, you know, take care of the ball and doing those kind of things. So that really came out today. And when we can get wins like this, um, you, know, it, it, you know, it's a special group. So. Hopefully, you know, we don't shoot this bad again, but, uh, you know, at least we know if we do, we have the attention to detail and the habits to still pull out a W. What's up, Josh? This is Will from The Athletic. Uh, another game with you guys hold an opponent to uh, under 100 points. Just what do you think about the, the strides you guys have made defensively early on in this process, I understand? Um, uh, it's, it's amazing. Um, you know, obviously, defense wins championships and um, you know, that's our goal, and Stan's done an amazing job defensively, and, and Bob and those kind of guys just drilling um, those things, having a great foundation, and, and you know, we can't, we can't speak enough about that. So defensively, you know, it, it's great to hold a team under, under 100 points. When you do that, uh, you put yourself in a position to win almost every night, so. Hey, Josh, Scott Kushner from NOLA.com. Uh, first game, kind of where Brandon uh, was the guy as far as taking over. Stan mentioned, you know, Drew had to kind of take that role last year. What did you think about Brandon down the stretch? And uh, he said he thought he played terrible down the, the stretch, but it seems like that's an important role for somebody to take the mantle of. Uh, and I mm -hmm. really kind of evaluate that. What did it mean to you guys? Yeah, no, he, uh, I mean, there, there was a, a lot of games last year where he, you know, he took control in the fourth quarter and helped us out. Obviously, Drew. Uh, you know, that was, for the most part, you know, it was cool, calm, collective under pressure, doing those kind of things. But B.I.'s had experience doing that. And today, obviously, was a big game of fourth quarter, get him the ball, he's going to make the right decisions. Um, you know, he didn't shoot the ball as great today, but, you know, he was still aggressive. He made the right decision, you know, he was when he was open and, you know, made, you know had shots he could make. He, he shot him. If he didn't, he got off the ball. So he did a great job on that. I guarantee you he's... Um, going to be watching film about that tonight and tomorrow and seeing what he can do to get better. But, um, you know, that's our all-star, and, you know, we're going to give him the ball in the full court every, you know, every time and let him create. What did you think about his game overall tonight? It seemed like he pulled you guys out of a couple of funks tonight. Yeah, I mean, you know, that, that's what we expect from him. He, you know, he, he's our all-star, all and, you know, he has the ability and the talent to go out there and control the game, whether that's, making shots or, um, you know, drawing to making the, the right pass and, you know, getting us a bucket in that kind of way. So I think that's something that's great for him. It makes him a special player because he's not just a scoring, you know, machine. He, he can make plays for other people. And I, I think that's special when you have a guy who's our go-to guy who realizes when a play call is called for me, it's not for me to go out there and just score. It's for me to go out there and get the best shot available for this team. And he doesn't, and he's, has done and will continue to do an amazing job with that. Hey Josh, it's uh, Andrew from ESPN. Uh, Stan has kind of talked before about you playing basically starters minutes and I don't think you came out of the game in the first half after you checked in the first. Uh, what about just being ready to kind of give these guys, you know, 18 minute stretches or 10, 12 minute stretches has uh, kind of been helpful for you in your game right now? Um, yeah, that's my job. Uh, I, I know um, obviously, I'm not a starter, but I know I got to go in, you know, when those guys, give those guys a breather and, um, you know, play as well as I can, give these, give these guys a spark off the bench, you know, let those guys get a rest. And then, um, you know, games like today where I'm playing well in the first half, I just continue all the, all the way through. And other times where um, I might get tired, you know, those guys come right back in. So I know that's my role. Um, I want to um, be great in that role. I want to um, help this team in any way I can. So. That's just you know a way for me to help help go out there and win games, and at the end of the day, that's all I really want to do, um, regardless of stats, numbers, and all that. You know, if I play 
10 minutes tonight, you know, and we won, I would have been good. So um, that's just my mentality of it. I just want to help this team any way I can and, you know, try and get to the playoffs for the first time, man. So, well, you know, whatever they need, you know, I'm trying to get there. Hey, Josh, uh, Christian Clark, just one more real quick. Uh, Lonzo had five steals in this game. Just what did you think about what he was able to do defensively? Oh, he, he, I mean, he did a great job. Uh, he, he um, within the passing lanes, especially in that, you know, late in that third quarter, you know, even early in that fourth, you know, when, you know, they went zone and um, our offense was a little stagnant. And we weren't, you know, getting 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 buckets like we were, you know, we were before. Um, he did a great job of getting in the passing lane, getting us easy baskets, and really helped us during that time. Obviously, like I said, offensively, we weren't, um, you know, putting as much points up, but he made key plays, key steals, key uh, deflections to you know, get us easy baskets. And when you're able to have a point guard like that, it, you know, it starts with him. He starts on the ball. So when he, he's locked in, he's engaged, um, he's an amazing defender. And, you know, we saw it today, and, and that's something that we got to expect from him every night. We got to hold him accountable when he's not doing those things. But he's a, he's a special guy with an uh, amazing talent of athleticism, um, instinct, and those kind of things. So. Um, no, he was, he was amazing for us today. Well, appreciate it. All right, we're all set. Thanks, Josh. Uh, yeah,